One morning, Lena, who worked as an office employee for a large company, woke up a bit later than usual. Today was a special day for her as she was about to try remote work for the first time, working from home. This had been agreed upon with her employer and Lena felt relieved that she could save the time usually spent commuting to the office. However, working from home also meant taking more responsibility for setting up her workspace. Lena knew that when working remotely, she needed to create a safe and comfortable working environment to maintain her health and well-being. She thought about the instructions her employer had given her earlier. She opened her laptop and temporarily placed it on the kitchen table. But after just half an hour, she realized something was wrong. The chair was too low and the table was uncomfortably high. Her back was starting to feel strained. Since this was a short-term remote work arrangement, Lena decided to use household items to make her workspace more ergonomic. She found a small cushion in the closet and placed it on the chair's backrest to provide better lower back support. This immediately helped reduce the strain on her back. She also found a few books to raise the table slightly. She used a thick stack of paper as a footrest, giving her feet the necessary support. Lena knew that working with a screen required additional equipment to avoid strain. So she connected her laptop to an external monitor, keyboard, and mouse, which her employer had provided. Now her workspace was much more comfortable and safer. She adjusted the monitor to the right height to prevent neck and eye strain, carefully following the instructions her employer had given her for setting up a proper workstation. Throughout the workday, Lena also had to remember to take regular breaks and move around. She set a reminder to get up every hour to do some stretching exercises or walk around the apartment to keep her body active. The lighting she had arranged for work was sufficient, but occasionally she heard street noise from outside, which disturbed her concentration. During these moments, she realized that if the noise became too much of a distraction, she would prefer to work in the office, where the environment is more controlled. By the end of the day, Lena was pleased that she had been able to create a comfortable and safe workspace while working from home. Although remote work initially seemed like a challenge, she had found practical solutions that made her workday smoother and more comfortable.